day in the life of Dr. Lowenstein begins. I'm on my way to pick up my son Atticus from daycare. And uh, you know, it's a normal day in LA. We're home, right bud? Huh. Yeah? Mm. Are you happy to be home? Dad, why are you waiting? Let's go inside, I'm hungry. <laughs> what do you think? What do you think of your yogurt? Um. This baby loves yogurt, even though his daddy's a vegan. <laughs> wow, the fork trick worked. <laughs> or did it? <laughs> He's gonna like it. <laughs> 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 Bright and early on a Friday morning. Baby's still asleep. Daddy needs to wake up. So good. Looks like the baby's awake. Jam Bear. He's playing that song again. Jam Bear. Oh, <laughs> oh yeah? You gonna walk over here? You're gonna walk to the camera? You wanna come here? Aww. You wanna read my palm? Oh, you're gonna eat it. Ow! Ow! You bit my finger twice. How do you like it? Yeah? I think it's your approval. So, Shanae, tell us about your day at school today. Hi, we have pajama day today. Yes, you do. <laughs> <laughs> you look very comfortable. Yeah, I know you're jealous. <laughs> have a good day. Getting settled in at school. Time to do some grading. Let's see. That should be enough. Let's get started. Not your best work. Hmm. Yeah. I don't know what grade to give this. I might not have enough ink. Hey everybody! Oh, this is Corliss. For what? For, okay, space, place, 400. Spaces and places for 400. This treaty ended the Mexican War and resulted in a huge territorial expansion for the U.S. 30 seconds. I see a hand, Sophie. The Treaty of Guadalupe is that is correct. That is correct. The pressure was on and Sophie pulled it off. And they wagered 59.99. But I think it's pretty clear who won because both got it right. Sans serifs, congratulations. You have won the midterm Jeopardy because there's still one to come for the fun. There is no final, just kidding. Uh, there's a portfolio that you guys get to write. Okay. Oh, sorry. All right. So where are we going right now? We're going to Cantor's Deli <laughs> as part of our field trip for the Jewish American Lit class. First semester, first class ever. <laughs> Woo! Woo! Yeah. Hi, yeah. Hey. Wait, turn around and point to it. <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> 
Hey, Maddie, what's the prayer for bread? Mama Tzila Kamin Haaretz We give thanks to God for bread Our voices rise in tongue together As our joyful prayer is said This, ladies and gentlemen, is a knish to destroy all knishes. Potato latkes, ladies and gentlemen. Mm. Everyone's having that. Look at this. Look at this spread. You got to get a Reuben. Latkes. Matzo ball soup. Thank you. Kaylee. Kaylee. <laughs> there are the Shabbos boys. If the lights went out in Cantor's after sundown tonight and we needed someone to turn them on, we could go. Do, yeah. That's who we go to. <laughs> Except that none of us are observant Jews, so we could all, anybody here could do it. But nevertheless, it is a holy and meaningful uh, role to play, and we thank you. Of course. Of course. Anytime. Anytime. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, so here it is to the first and so far best Jewish American literature class It is a high bar to beat, and thank you guys for joining me here at Campus today. Machayam! Well, here we are again, almost exactly 24 hours later. From the beginning of this vlog, Dr. Ronstein's day. What are we doing now, bud? Picked you up from daycare. Now we're gonna go to Sprouts. All right, let's get a cart. Atticus, you having fun? Is this your favorite thing in the world? <laughs> hey, yeah. <laughs> Thanks for helping clean up, man. I'd say this is a, a really good day for Dr. Lowenstein. Ending on a high note, or a low note, however you want to interpret this. <laughs> what a good sweeper. That's it for a day in the life of Dr. Lowenstein. See you on the flip side.